Hi everyone, thank you for watching. If you're watching this video on YouTube, don't forget to hit subscribe below. All of the ad revenue that we generate from these videos goes to local New Zealand charities. Today we're talking about offset mortgages and why you might consider using them rather than a revolving credit mortgage. Now, not all banks offer offset mortgages as a product, but if they do, it's something worth considering for those of you who like to categorize your money into separate buckets. Let's say you've got $50,000 that you might want to pay off or reduce quickly over the next year. So you wouldn't want to fix it on a fixed rate term for a year. You want to make extra payments on it. At most banks, you've got the option for a revolving credit, which is a lot like a large overdraft. If you've got a $50,000 debt and you put in $10,000 that night, you only pay interest on $40,000, on the remaining $40,000. But with an offset account, you allocate the amount of debt, so let's say $50,000, and then you allocate several other bank accounts that you want to offset that debt in. So you might have $5,000 in one bank account and that's called for your holiday fund. That's called a holiday fund. And there might be another $5,000 and that is for tax that you're saving up to pay your tax if you're self-employed or a contractor. And all of those accounts that you've nominated, they don't earn any interest, but they do reduce the debt, the amount of debt that you've got against your offset account. Now you can often have up to 20 or so accounts and really good way if you're budgeting to put your savings into different accounts but still reduce your mortgage. One little trick about offset mortgages though is that you can also allocate related person's bank accounts. Now if your mum and dad have some cash lying around but they don't necessarily want to give it to you, as long as it's in the same bank they could allocate that bank account to offset your mortgage. Now Here's a good example. If they had $100,000 sitting around in cash, they didn't want to give it to you, but they want to help you reduce your mortgage. You could set up a $100,000 offset account, nominate their account as the offset account, and that would cancel out the debt. So you wouldn't pay any interest on that $100,000. They've still got control of the money. They have the right to grab that money if they need it for health reasons or they want to buy a motorhome or something. But in the meantime, they're saving you probably around three to three and a half thousand dollars a year, which you can then use to pay down your mortgage even faster. Really good way for mum and dad to help you with a mortgage, but not hand over any money and retain full control of that money. Or put your savings into different buckets. So it might be tax, it might be holiday, it might be your children's education fund, and that will, in the meantime, lower the interest that you're paying on your mortgage. Thank you for watching, we'll talk to you soon. <music>